Hey, guys. Hey. Hey. All right. Here's the ring. <gasps> yes. Yes. A thousand times yes. <laughs> what about me? You, you just said I could. I'm not even getting married. <laughs> okay, this is a question for science fiction writers. I can't believe you're not picking me. Hey, how could it not be me? I'm not even... I don't even... All right, you know what? <laughs> That's it. From now on, Joey, I want you to be my best man. Yes! Shame about you, though. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye, you fruit-drying psychopath. Monica? <laughs> time is it? Uh, nine. <laughs> but it's dark out. Um, well, that's because you always sleep till noon, silly. <laughs> <laughs> this is what nine looks like. <laughs> I guess I'll get washed up then. Watch that sunrise. I mean, it's great, but... I know it's great. <laughs> oh, I don't want to see that. Chandler, for so long, I, I wondered if I would ever find my prince, my soulmate. Then three years ago, at another wedding, I turned to a friend for comfort. And instead, I found everything that I'd ever been looking for my whole life. And now, here we are with our future before us. And I only want to spend it with you. My prince, my soulmate, my friend. Unless you don't want to. <laughs> Monica, I thought this was going to be the most difficult thing I ever had to do. But when I saw you walking down that aisle, I realized how simple it was. I love you. Any surprises that come our way, it's okay because I will always love you. You are the person I was meant to spend the rest of my life with. You want to know if I'm sure? You uh, may now kiss the bride. I pronounce you husband and wife. Now kiss her again. All right, there's a nuclear holocaust. I'm the last man on Earth. Would you go out with me? Yeah. I've got canned goods. <laughs> hey, you guys, take a look at this. So I, uh, I turned to Chandler. <laughs> Joy kept screaming at me, do it now, do it, do it, do it now. Sometimes late at night, I can still hear the screaming. <laughs> That's because sometimes I just do it through my wall to freak you out. Get up. What? Near my seat. How is this your seat? Because I was sitting there. But then you left. Well, it's not like I went to Spain. I went to the bathroom. You knew I was coming back. What's the big deal? Sit somewhere else. The big deal is I was sitting there last. So, it's my seat. Well, 
Actually, the last place you were sitting was in there, so... <laughs> you guys, you know what? You know what? It doesn't matter. Because you both have to go get dressed before the big vein in my head pops. <laughs> so... All right, Ross, I just have to do one thing really oh. quickly. It's right. not a big deal. Get up! <laughs> All right, fine. You know what? We'll both sit in the chair. Fine with me. No. Oh. <laughs> I'm so comfortable. Me too. In fact, I think I might be a little too comfortable. All right. <laughs> okay, look, we have 19 minutes, okay? Chandler, I want you to go and change, okay? And then when you come back, Joey will go change, and he'll have vacated the chair, okay? Okay. All right. Fine. I'm going. When I get back, it's Chair City, and I'm the guy who's sitting in a chair. <laughs> You will notice that I am fully dressed. I, in turn, have noticed that you are not. So, in the words of A.A. A. Milne, get out of my chair, deal hole. <laughs> okay. What are you doing? Well, you said I had to give you the chair. You didn't see anything about the cushions. The cushions are the essence of the chair. That's right. I'm taking the essence. <laughs> oh, he'll be back. Oh, there's nobody in the room. Where's my underwear? Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, come on, what? You took his underwear? He took my essence. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Joey, why, why can't you just wear the underwear you're wearing now? Because I'm not wearing any underwear now. <laughs> okay, um, then why do you have to wear underwear tonight? It's a rented tux, okay? I'm not gonna go commando in another man's fatigue. <laughs> Well, then it looks like somebody's gonna have to give somebody back his cushions. Okay. You hide my clothes, I'm gonna do the exact opposite to you. <laughs> what are you... What are you gonna show me my clothes? <laughs> hey, opposite... is opposite. <laughs> He's got nothing! <laughs> okay, buddy boy, here it is. You hide my clothes, I'm wearing everything you own. Oh, my God! That is so not the opposite of taking somebody's underwear. Look at me. I'm Chandler. Could I be wearing any more clothes? Maybe if I wasn't going commando. Yeah. Whew. I'll tell you, it's hot with all this stuff on. I, uh, I better not do any, I don't know, Lunges. <laughs> okay, okay, enough, enough with the lunging. No, I'm sick of this, okay? I've had it up to here with you two. Neither of you can come to the party. Jeez, what a baby. Ground control to Major Tom. <laughs> Commencing countdown. Engines on. It's uh, scenes from next week's show, next week. I am definitely going to watch that. All right, no peeking. No peeking. No peeking. No peeking. All right, all right. But you better be wearing clothes when I open my eyes. <laughs> all right, open your eyes. Sweet mother of all that is good and pure. <laughs> Huh? Days of our lives picked up my option. Congratulations! <laughs> now we can finally watch Green Acres the way it was meant to be seen. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, uh, which one is mine? Whichever one you want, man. Whichever one you want. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yeah, that's the stuff. <laughs> oh. Do we dare? We dare. Oh. 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 So I'm back in high school. I'm standing in the middle of the cafeteria, and I realize I am totally naked. Oh, yeah. Oh, that, that, that. Then I look down, and I realize there is a phone there. <laughs> Instead of... That's right! <laughs> I never had that. Oh. 
All of a sudden, the phone starts to ring. And it turns out it's my mother. Which is very, very weird because she never calls me. I feel like someone reached down my throat, grabbed my small intestine, pulled it out of my mouth, and tied it around my neck. Cookie? <laughs> Carol moved her stuff out today. Want to be single, okay? I just, I just, I just want to be married again. <laughs> and I just want a million dollars. Oh, honey. Let me just say something, because once we get into this, I'm gonna get all uncomfortable and probably make some stupid joke. I just want to say that I, I love you. And I'm going to miss you. And I'm so sad that you're leaving. Oh, you know what? Let's not say anything else. I love you. <laughs> mm, not so tight. Oh! <laughs>